starting off from Pilot Rock. Starting off the back way, it did on X and it led us to right here. Last time we, we ended up behind the reservoir and started, but I guess this is the correct spot to start. Took off the door. Uh, it's kind of chilly out here, it's about 45 degrees. Um, beautiful out here. Sun is shining, but we had some rain. So we're gonna have us a little wet ride. You can see a little bit of frost on there. Should be pretty nice. Airing down right now, we're gonna lock our hubs. Me and the neighbor out here messing around. We're gonna get his first trail in on on his first uh 420. on his 420 here. Let's see how she goes. He's been driving it for like two weeks around his house and doing his little calculations and manipulations. So yeah, we're ready for it. Brought a slum dog out of hibernation. Got the wife with us today. And we're off. Last time I did this trail, we were out back behind the uh, reservoir and it started over here. Um, but uh, today, Onyx, you know, I, I navigated through Onyx and it took me to the staging area. So it's a little bit, a uh, little bit farther, but uh, that's all right with me. You get to experience the whole trail, I guess. <laughs> Got this microphone on now so I could, uh, talk freely instead of screaming into the phone or the or into the camera kind of distracting but now I can talk freely got my second phone my old phone hooked up and I got a GPS satellite tracker on here so we got uh, positive uh, whereabouts of where we're going so that's a good thing. with us today. She's comfortable in her snow gear. Yep. <laughs> oh, very nice. Oh, nice water. Anyway. <clears throat> yeah, this area got a lot of rain the last few days. Nice big puddle here, I'm gonna hug the edge. The neighbor's testing out his first gear, his low gear, granny gear. <laughs> He's probably smiling. <laughs> so we had like a 50 mile ride from our house to get to the start of this trail. So that was an evolution in itself. But uh, we were just cruising it along on the freeway at 65. Both of us got 538 gears, so we didn't let the RPMs get up too high.
this would help if I put it in low gear. There we go. Here goes a biggie. saddle here. That's better. They're tipping pretty hard on the driver's front left. Gonna get some scratches here. are pretty washed out.
lights here. about on the side here? Uh, How about a handle there? Would you put your handle there like, like that? Yeah. Both sides? Maybe. Uh-huh. Alright. I think that'll work better. That way I don't have to mess up my dash. Uh, <laughs> yeah. That, this would work. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. There we go. And a harness. Uh, you want a harness? <laughs> no problemo. No guy with a welder, he'll do it up. end of uh, Big Bear, Big Bear Mountains. You come up through Cajon Pass and then uh, you hit the beginning of the trail right off the 15 freeway. It's a real popular trail for Southern California guys. Uh, we're pretty lucky no one is on it today. Usually this is like a freeway. Everybody cruising their stuff. Maybe because it's Christmas Day that <laughs> no one's here. They're probably all sleeping off a hangover. <laughs> oh, Merry Christmas, by the way. <laughs> My wife saw, what do you want to do today? I got I want to go on Jeep, Jeep trail. And she's like, okay. <laughs> Sounds good to me. <laughs> Switch it second gear. Yeah, so the neighbor's Jeep, he put like 500 miles on it, he says, up and down. I don't know, in his neighborhood, he 
was uh, making sure everything worked. And he's pretty confident now. Hopefully, it, hopefully we get through this trail. It'll be his first one on that new transmission. On his second transmission, I should say. <laughs> Take us all the way up and then uh, take us right into uh, Lake Arrowhead. This is on the west end of uh, Big Bear. It's beautiful, beautiful area, beautiful time of year. Too bad we didn't get no snow. It just came down rain. We got the full top on today. My wife can't put the doors on, put the back curtain on. It's pretty toasty. I had to open up the back end here. So it's uh, it gets pretty hot. So she's still in her snow gear. <laughs> she ain't taking no chances. <laughs> Tracking on Gaia right now. Bread crumbing it. So I this has on X on it, but I forgot my uh, password. Uh, so I didn't want to go through the whole nonsense. I want to get on this trail, so I just put it on Gaia, and this is, this worked just fine. This is gonna take us. You can see it. The trail is where we started last time. The blue. That's what we did last time over here by the lake. But today we came out this way because on uh, on her phone, on my phone, it brought us to the staging area. So we started today off the staging area instead of a, the regular area that we usually do. this hooked up to the satellite getter uh, Garmin Glow 2 I think it's called Amazon special <laughs> Slumdog. It's beautiful out here. So that's Silverwood Lake. Uh, that's Cajon Pass going up into the high desert. Victorville. Um, Barstow's up that way. Um, let's see here. There's some good trails out here. We'll be doing some of those probably in spring. Trails, trails, trails. Uh, 15 Freeway goes right up there. Route 66 is right here. Yeah, so we're gonna keep following this around. Down there, where those roads are. And then we go up to the gatekeeper and on that ridge line, see on that ridge line right there, that's gonna be the Pilot Rock. We get all the way up into the Pilot Rock area. Um, and right up into uh, Lake Arrowhead.
beautiful out here. There's silver wood from the top. <laughs> beautiful. Yeah. King of the Hammers is up back that way. We'll be there next month. Anybody, anybody want to go? We got to pick a couple days and we'll go down there. Well, one day, I guess. <laughs> Hopefully during the week. Other people are crazy over there. So during the day, during the week, that's more of a old man style that I like to do. We made it to where the blue is. That's where we started the last time. And behind us is the gatekeeper. Let's turn around, check that out. The lake is right there. Let's turn this around. the gatekeeper and that's where we are gonna go this pilot rock is past that so yeah we go granny low all the way up so yeah hopefully it's not wet it doesn't look wet and if it's not wet, then we'll go with the same PSI. But if I start getting up there, start slipping, then uh, we're going to have to take out some air. Yeah. Maybe not. I don't know. I'm going to try it like this. Go fast. Yeah. Go stand right there. Get a... Yeah, that's how big it is. He's about five foot four. So what is that, like 5, 10, 15, 20? A 20 foot climb right there. Pretty cool. Nice trail, huh? Fun. Nice trail. Fun. That's nice. Yeah. So that's why we came up right there. Came up that way, up those mountains, and back around. But uh, we came back this way, and I'm going to go up towards Lake Arrowhead.
back on it, messing around with the drone. Uh, it didn't like us being out here. It wasn't being very compliant. To our fun. side looks easier <laughs> hope I'm not mistaken
what they give the name to that right side, but that the right side is the rough one. It's real loose. And uh, a lot of people flip the rigs there. A lot of motorcycle guys come tumbling down. <laughs> so we'll go on to the left side. <laughs> definitely made this easy trail into a little bit more challenging one. Right side's the hardest one. One of these days I'll do the right side. But today is not the day. <laughs> first.
that's not good. And granny low right now it's gonna tractor it up over here keep nice and controlled just in case You worried, huh? Yeah. Go further, babe. <laughs> further? Yeah, because she's gonna make me stop in the sleep. All right. Break. Yeah. Take a little break. Let's go take a look. Go check in yep. the bottom. Nah, it's fine. Got high centered back there. Scared the wife. It's pretty hairy. There's just some really loose gravel here. Oh, he hasn't started yet. So the side I picked is uh, supposed to be the easier side. And then this one is the harder side. The, the gravel here is really loose. So Slumdog was having a hard time getting some traction down there. Granny low. You see my tracks right in the edge of that Freaking Hey, this thing's shaking away. <laughs> he took a better line. You see right next to him is where I high centered.
Yeah, the gravel's like really, really loose. Pick the right line. Goes up there, no problem. <laughs> so if you guys are coming here, don't go the way I did. <laughs> huh? Oh shit! That's what I was, that's what I was calling you. Yeah. You have a high center hop in. Just plowing, and then when you're backing up, dude, it was just like dirt <laughs> like this. Off the, <laughs> like, the tires, like, basically weren't even on the ground, it was just the dirt. Is that right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they're planting corn. Yeah, planting corn. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I definitely took the wrong line. <laughs> 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 Plowing fields over here. Uh. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> like, ah, oh, man, I don't want to get out. <laughs> Happy? <laughs> All right. <laughs> the road went like this, and then the deer was high in the middle. Yeah. And the jeep was just. Yeah. <laughs> so I plowed it down for you. That's why you made it look so easy. <laughs> We're up into the tree line now. Hopefully it gets a little bit easier. The ground is really soft though. We're slipping and sliding all over the place. Let's go take a look at that area. Oh, there he is. He's yeah, he's right behind us. He's doing exactly what we, he's doing the opposite. <laughs> Dude, I almost flipped this thing. Uh. <laughs> you're like this, and you're like that. All right. Like Damn, that thing was gnarly right now. <laughs> Let's go oh, take. Damn! <laughs> Pretty hairy area right here. Yeah. Right there, I sunk in. I thought I was gonna land on my side right here. <laughs> we came up through that, and my tire went into there. And we went totally to the side. I mean, man, we were like 
sixteenth of an inch away from putting slum dog on the side there, and we rode it out here just barely. Turned the wheel to the right, man. Pile of rocks supposed to be an easy trail. <laughs> Man, turn into a black diamond. <laughs> you showed me not where to go. Yeah, huh? <laughs> so man, he's doing good because he's not he's going exactly where I'm not going. <laughs> Got a little bit there. Alright. One hand driving. <laughs> <laughs> that boy is good. Mm-hmm. Good and terrible. Freaking cool. We're getting there. It's getting closer. Okay, now hopefully it's not as hairy anymore. Got up on two wheels, three wheels. <laughs> First gear. Oops.
Made it up. Pilot Rock. Yeah. Huh? A boat? <laughs> you need a new stable anyways. <laughs> Yeah, you better tighten that, dude. <laughs> All right, we finally connected to the county road. We started making some time. This was supposed to be an easy, squeezy, Wham, bam, and pleasey <laughs> ride through Pilot Rock, which is usually should only take like two hours, but uh, well, here we are, four and a half hours into it. It just got destroyed by the last few rainstorms that went through here. Man, we had a tough time. Well, that's cool. Started out this morning cold, like about 45 degrees, 46 degrees. And then uh, as the sun came out, it got warmer, probably up to about 60 or something. And right now the sun's starting to go down and it's starting to get cooler again. We still gotta get off the, the hard, uh, get off the dirt road and then head on up to Lake Arrowhead and then back down the mountain up the front side into San Bernardino. Yeah, about another two hour ride ahead of us. This whole trek is probably about 100 miles, 50 to the start of the trail. And then the trail's probably like another 10. And then the way back's probably about another 40. Out of water. Should have brought our lunch. <laughs> There's a street right there. It's gonna be easy, dude. I'm telling you. <laughs> Drops right in. Drops right in. Weekend. <laughs> you alright? <laughs> yeah. It's all good. Upgrades. It's all upgrades now. Let's check out and see what kind of damage we took. I'm just glad we didn't have to burn the Virgin Mary candle in the house. <laughs> <laughs> Got plenty of pinstripes. Really? <laughs> Didn't fire the gardener over there. <laughs> didn't take care of all the trees. Good thing we didn't need the winch because I forgot their controller. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Uh, off of it. A little bit of pinstripes. Oh, yeah, we got a little owie there. A little owie. Yeah. I'm just glad a bunch of bonders didn't fall out. Yeah. Put some bondo on it, be fine. <laughs> Ooh, some good scratches here. Yeah, this got Oh man. I almost took it off there. Yeah. It'll buff out. <laughs> uh, I didn't film it, but he uh his fuel pump went out. So I had a spare one with me. Yeah. Switched it out real quick on the trail. Then uh, that's pretty much it for the trail. We're gonna unlock our hubs, air up, and then we gotta head up that road up into Lake Arrowhead, and then back down the other side into San Bernardino, and then head up on the freeway. Yep. Let's get to it. 
Poor Jeeps. We were just supposed to go for a nice little Sunday drive. <laughs> Stop it!